Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of the Ball Fake Podcast. If you're watching on YouTube, make sure to like, subscribe, and support our new movement by putting Let's Go Viral in the comment section. But if you're listening on Apple Podcasts or Spotify, make sure to give us a five-star rating and a nice review. But without further ado, here are your hosts, Nicely Chunga Benny and Greg King. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another quick NBA update video here on the Ball Fake Podcast, members of the Off the Ball Network. And in today's video, we got some good news for you Lakers fans out there as Anthony Davis has been reportedly expected to return today against the ninth-seeded New Orleans Pelicans. Davis, who suffered from a midfoot sprain against the Utah Jazz on February 16th, hasn't played since before the All-Star break. The eight-time All-Star has only played in 37 games this season and has never played in 70 or more games throughout his 10-year tenure in the NBA, aside from the 2007 and 2018 season. Davis's absence certainly hasn't helped the Lakers in any regard this season as they're currently the 11th seed in the Western Conference and will have to finish the final stretch of the regular season with a better record than the conference foes San Antonio Spurs in order to establish themselves into the play-in tournament this year. Although the Spurs and Lakers both sit at 31 and 45 on the season, San Antonio was awarded the 10th seed over the Los Angeles Lakers because they performed better against their conference opponents. Now, given the Lakers have lost four of their last five games and six of their last 21, they're still not completely out of the playoff picture just yet. With LeBron James possibly returning back into this rotation tonight as a game time decision alongside with all-star caliber center Anthony Davis, the Lakers hope to build momentum in the final six game stretch of the season. LeBron has been sidelined for two of the last three games due to left knee soreness and an ankle injury, but despite dealing with a few minor injuries this season, LeBron has completely defied the laws of physics by playing at an MVP level in his 19th season. James is currently leading all scores in the NBA this season in points per game at 30.1, recently became the first player in NBA history to record 30,000 points, 10,000 rebounds, and 10,000 assists, and just surpassed Utah Jazz legend Karl Malone for second place all-time on the NBA all-time leading scores list. And although this season has certainly been an utterly disappointing one for the Purple and Gold, with Davis making a return to the lineup and James possibly being close to a return as well alongside Anthony Davis, Lakers fans could have something to look forward to as Los Angeles gears up for one more final push for the season but you guys let me know what y'all think about this here in the comment section thank you guys so much for tuning in to another video of me here on the ball fake podcast if you're new to our youtube channel or listening on apple Podcasts or spotify do me a quick favor by like commenting and subscribing to our youtube channel and giving us a nicer review and a five star rating on apple Podcasts and spotify i would greatly appreciate that but other than that it's your boy dicey chunga benny you're listening to the ball fake podcast and we out praise god <laughs>